This is Chris, the Idaho Painter here on Paint Live TV. Today we're out here painting a house again. So we got a house behind me. This thing is five colors, about 2,000 square feet. Very complicated, but we're gonna do this once again in a day. So I'm gonna run around here, show you the Paint Life crew, and I'm gonna grab Zach. We got Captain Zach here, and we're gonna show you what Zach's doing here. Kind of cool. He's putting some plastic on ladder boots. We'll have Zach walk us around and tell us what the heck was going on in this job site. What are you doing, Zach? Uh, right now I'm putting some plastic on the boots, so that way when you lean it up against the house, it's not going to mark up the brand new paint. That's pretty cool. So if you take and lean the ladder on the house with just a regular boot, it'll mark up the paint? Yeah. Yep. And uh, I know it'll stick to the paint too, what we call tacking to the paint. So this house, it's about 2,000 square foot, right Zach? Uh, yeah. What did you do when you first got here? Uh, when I first got here, I had most of the guys start masking and I started setting up pumps. Setting up pumps. You got How many pumps did you have going today? Uh, we had five total. Five pumps going today? Yeah, we had five pumps. Oh my goodness. So let's um, walk around, Zach. You can show me five pumps. We'll see what pumps we got going on. So we had how many colors on the house? Uh, we have five colors. Five colors, so you had five pumps. So I see, Zach, we got one pump here. You've got a Titan 1140 going right here. Yeah, this is what we put the body in. So. This? Yep. So somebody, sounds like somebody's still spraying. We got, oh, uh, we do have Journey, Journeyman John still up spraying the body. So you had another pump over here yep. going. We got so. Graco 395. So we've got a Graco 395 running right here. And yeah. what, what, what were you... Um, we were spraying the shakes with it, and it's like halfway cleaned out now. But. So spraying the shakes, so we got the shakes. That's a blue color up there? Yep. Cool, so who sprayed the shakes? Uh, John did. So John sprayed the shakes. I think you sprayed, um, I saw you spraying the door today. So come over here, show me this door, Zach. Yeah. So you worked... All the doors are this bright red color right here. So, um, I think you were sanding this thing. You first started off by sanding it with a festool, didn't you? Yeah. So what was your process of painting this door? Um, so, first we, we had to mask it, and then I went through and just kind of, um, there was a lot of brush strokes, so I sanded all those down with the festool, and then there was some checking as well. So we, we sanded those down, we caulked them, did a little bit of bondo work, and then uh, sanded again, and then painted. And how many coats did you spray on this thing? Three coats. It was a red door before, right? Yes. But you still did three coats. I think you sprayed a real a light fog coat the first time, right? Yeah, I did two light fog coats, and then yep. the third time was just a regular. So about what time is it right now? Uh, what, I believe it's just past two. So what time did you get the crew? What time did you get the crew going on this thing today? We're at about 7.05 this morning. And you have how many guys were you running here today? That's a lot. Everybody wants to know that. Three, four, five, six, seven, counting Chris. Seven, counting me, and I really don't count because I haven't accomplished a whole lot but making videos today. A lot of videos today. Um, so let's take, let's walk around over here on this side. Um, what other, is there any other pumps going right now? Yes, All the pumps. The red pump still loaded up in the back, and then we've got... So you had multiple doors red, right? Yeah, we, all the back doors, I don't think there's a gate over here. So I saw you, um, you were up there doing those corbels black right there. Yeah, did you, corbels were black. Did you spray those corbels, or did you hand do them? I just handed them. So what um, process, we sprayed the body, right? Yes. Uh, what else did we spray? We sprayed the Tudor board, or the batten board, whatever you, you want to call it. So, so uh, the paraffin wax or wax hybrid carbon comes to the top of the surface. Like Zach said, paint won't adhere to it, so you got to oil prime it, right? Got to oil prime it. What kind of oil primer did you use? We have a Sherwin Williams fast drying primer. Do you like oil priming? No, it stinks. Were you smart enough to give it to somebody else to do? I wasn't. Not no. Today. That's where you're going to have to get better at managing. There we go. <laughs> give the crappy jobs to somebody else. Give it to Lucas. <laughs> oh, we did. So here's Lucas. So Lucas, we found Lucas, another paint life guy. He's just, how's it going, Lucas? So, really good. So what have you been working on today? Um, face shab and window. Face shab and, and window, window trims. Yeah. Do you any masking today? And masking a little bit and paper in the, in the rock here. Where's the accent from, Lucas? Uh, it's got color. The, the, ta the talking and the accent. 
Uh, mi acento argentino. Argentina. Sí. Um, are they going to win the World Cup? Oh, uh, I'm win. Uh, hopefully Argentina will win. Um, Messi didn't do too well the last game. Yeah, and missing uh, the the last penalty on killing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That wasn't too good. Give a shout out to your family. All right. Nice. Thank you so much. Y gracias. Y espero que vean este video en Argentina. I have no idea what he said. <laughs> Thank you, Chris. <laughs> so, here's the house. I'll try to give you a whole look at it right here. We're just, once again, cruising right along. It's got five colors. So, it's a two-story house. Um, I don't know, Reagan's cruising around here, another paint line. Oh, here's Journeyman John. John, do you have anything to say? Anything unusual with this house went on? Do you have uh, any words of wisdom? No, you know, it's a hot day, so one of the things we try to do is get our guys up doing fascia and stuff right away, at least two guys. So we did have the full crew here today, which was, it's always helpful to have more bodies, but it's just about trying to manage what you want to get done first so that people aren't miserable when it's 2 o'clock and 90 degrees out. Get off the roof as fast as you can. We've got a video on that, on what to paint first when it's really hot outside. Mm -hmm. So the faster you can get off the roof, the easier your job will be and the less miserable it will be. Oh, there's Reagan. So there's one more member of the crew. Let's see what Reagan has to say. Um, Reagan, do you have any words of wisdom for everybody out there? Uh, He's put on the no, spot. No. Put on the spot. Just do a good job. <laughs> <laughs> there, there you go. Words of wisdom from Reagan. So Reagan's been with us for like three years now and he is running and managing the prep crew. So when they don't have houses to prep, he's here painting with us. So yeah, he's a soccer player, um, college soccer player. So there you have, I'll try to give you a, a full look way out here, walk you back so you can see the whole backside of the house. Also, it's like I said, it's about 2000 square feet. Once again, it'll be done today. We'll be done in about an hour. So I think Zach said it was like around two o'clock or so. We should be done around three o'clock and then sometimes we'll just move on to go do another prepping job. But right now we're building our Paint Life Academy. So we're gonna go work on our Paint Life Academy, doing some drywall and siding. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. A look at painting a house in a day again and doing quality work. So there's Zach. So Zach is up there um, hand brushing the corbels. What color are you brushing those corbels, Zach? Tricorn black. Tricorn black. So he's brushing them and he is he's a master with a brush. Zach can kill it with a brush. So John, I'm sure people are gonna ask because these colors are pretty cool. So do you have any idea what the colors are on this house i do we have light classic no classic french gray light french gray one of those it's light french gray on the body classic light buff on the trim that's what it is positive red on the door bungle house blue on the shakes and tricorn black on the the corbels there you go that's memory for you right there yeah. Big good time. Good. It's an awesome color scheme. It actually is really, really cool. So, um, product we're using today, um, we're using um, paint. We're using duration today. So, if anybody, you know, are the, are the shakes up there, are they flat? They are flat. So, the shakes are flat. We, and why do we do the shakes flat, John? It kind of gives it more of that wood like appearance and then also creates a little bit of depth to the house. So, you don't just have everything kind of looking the same it also just makes them look more like wood shakes and, and not like they're some big plastic thing and why the heck do we use satin on the body uh scrubability and durability so yeah. you know some places i hear like in the midwest they really like flat on all their exteriors yeah and i think like semi-gloss down like on the coast because yeah, they yeah. Can scrub the salt residue yeah and uh the flat just wouldn't hold up very well here it wouldn't be as durable uh, but yeah. Yeah. But on the, the shakes, we're going for like a true wood look, so it looks a lot better. Yeah. So there you go. If you guys have any questions, just leave them down in the comments below. We answer all our comments, typically. Hope you guys enjoyed this. A look at the Paint Life crew and what the heck we do. See ya.